road? Oh, no! process of um as far as this goes um we are going to keep him uh for um five days not including today um waiting for someone to come and look for him okay um if no one comes to look for him in those five days he'll go up for um evaluation uh if he passes evaluation if he's healthy and he's friendly which he looks healthy and friendly um then he'll go up for adoption okay um and then we will keep him there until either he gets adopted or until someone goes come looking for him grocery store had diddly uh i got i did get some like fruit and stuff but i really wanted so chipotle bam and it's five o'clock now so we're gonna get to vegas at like 1 30 or 2 and i gotta be up at 6 for my first breakfast meeting with uh a client <laughs> Tomorrow's gonna be a crazy day for me and I gotta get all my food loaded in my backpack because uh, I'm gonna have meeting after meeting after meeting tomorrow and um, a lot of these meetings are gonna be like during breakfast or at lunch or during dinner and uh, I don't want to be caught in a position where I'm starving and don't have anything to eat so I got bananas and nuts and apples and grapes and like this thing is gonna be for my breakfast so I'm gonna load this all stuff in my backpack and this is what I'm gonna carry around all day tomorrow full of food You come here. Give me a hug. What a crazy day that was. 
just got back to the hotel it's about six o'clock and then I got to do that whole thing again tomorrow starting at eight so time to get some food nope 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 hey, do you have anything uh vegan that's yeah, super annoying yeah we could do vegetable fajitas we have cheese enchiladas do you have anything that doesn't have any dairy in it? Beans with no, but the beans have lard in it, so you can do that. How much would it cost to do sizzling veggies and rice? 13 bucks. Oh. All right, so I scooped off the uh, top layer of my old Chipotle burrito uh, from yesterday because I looked for something to eat uh, here in the restaurant and there's nothing. I can't, there's nothing to get. So I'm gonna uh, eat my leftovers because I really don't want to get back in the car and go drive somewhere t vegan super far away. So I'm just gonna eat this, but I want it to be hot. So. <laughs> Taking way too long, it's not even warming it up, so. Cold burrito for me. such a nightmare so I gotta like get my wife and kid to check out of their room and then like hang out in the lobby so that I can like re-get a new room Here in Vegas and I've decided that I don't want to go back to SEMA that I would rather take the fam bam and head to Red Rock and do some exploring I think that I can always be a millionaire I can't always spend time with my family at Red Rock let's go morning Thank you, sir. of business going on uh, thank you guys so much for watching I really appreciate it check out all my other stuff I'm gonna make a lot more videos coming up so guys vegan cyclist yeah. <laughs> so that was a nuts of an experience I really feel bad, but I don't know what to do in this situation because that dog was fully someone's pet. And so I tried to find it at home. Um, I looked on Craigslist, I did everything. I exhausted every option. I called every no-kill shelter. I did everything I could to find it the best possible home. Everyone just said, you have to give it to the SPCA. Um, 
the guy obviously you heard he told me the whole process about it but I'm sure that someone loves that dog and is gonna call looking for it and so honestly that's probably the the only option that was the best option to return it to its owner crazy <laughs>